All right, so here I'm just going to show you guys how to uh, discharge the main capacitor for the Canon 580 EX2. This way, hopefully, you don't kill yourself when you're taking this thing apart because um, your flash bulb probably burned out due to a manufacturer error. There seems to be a lot of these that are blowing lately, and mine was was one of them. So. You can't really tell from here, but once I take it apart, I'll know for sure if it's, if it's the bulb or, or what it is. Um, basically, when you test the pilot light, nothing happens. I, I'll have power, but no flash on the test flash, so that tells me it's probably the flash bulb. Also, I wanted to tell you guys that uh, your warranty will be void if you if you do this if you start taking this thing apart so I'd highly recommend if you still have uh, a warranty left to send it in a cannon and let them fix it alright so what we're going to be doing is taking it apart to see what we can do to fix it seeing as my warranty is no longer good the first thing you want to do is discharge the main capacitor and I've seen a lot of people, a lot of videos of people just doing crazy things to, to try and discharge one of these. Some people don't even know that there's a capacitor in there. But this one here, uh, the batteries I've taken out two days ago. No batteries in there. It's been sitting for a while. Uh, I tried to fire it a few times. So you would think that there's no voltage in there, but... In actuality, that capacitor is holding a lot of voltage. We're going to find out how much right now. 237 volts. So that's enough to kill you, with, you know, without a doubt. So all you have to do, connect uh, the ground wire up here to the plate. Do not let this wire touch the contacts. These little these little bubbles down there that connect up to the camera and then we're going to use about a 500 ohm resistor um, this one's a little more than that but that's alright in line this goes right into the hole that the manufacturer put this for to discharge the capacitor so then we're going to just let it di discharge away here And that's it for now. We'll check it in a little bit. Okay, it's been about three minutes or so. We're down to two volts. And this is a uh, 3200 ohm resistor. And it's slowly coming coming to an end. It's pretty easy to do. All you do is just take the side cover off. And connect a resistor up to it. And then you don't kill yourself. Well, just about done here. I wanted to also say I would highly recommend that you buy one of these service manuals you can get them online for like 16 bucks you can download it <clears throat> it's everything you needed to know about the 580 so it's their service manual I'll leave a link on how you can get this and also you might want to check these guys out he doesn't seem to be too happy with Canon uh, I guess there's a I don't know if they're rumors or it's true, but there seems to be some issues with these these flashes burning up. So uh, this guy here, it's fake Chuck Westfall. I'm sure if you Google him, that's how I found him. 
it's going to tell you all the issues you have with this 580. So, I don't know if they're true or not, but something you might want to check out. Well, good luck to you. We're out of here. Well, I just pulled the top cover off, and sure enough, the flash bulb's done. It's pretty much cooked. So, uh, shame on Canon. This thing is just over a year old. My warranty just expired. And this, this shouldn't happen.